One of the biggest problems I noticed too is when sales managers who were sales reps try to Hello everyone, welcome to Management Secrets with your host, Brandon Bornance. In today's topic, I wanna to talk about could sales reps be great sales managers? A lot of people think, hey, sales reps can't be great sales managers. Sales managers can't be great sales reps. Let me tell you something, some of my best sales managers were sales reps. And let me tell you something, some of my best sales reps were my worst sales managers and by the way i'm i'm here in miami guys uh traveling for a conference so uh that's why i'm here outside but my my top sales reps that couldn't transition to become a great sales manager the reason why they couldn't transition was because they only were focused on themselves their own performance when you transition from a sales rep to sales manager you have to go all in on helping the team inspiring people to do more and believe more and achieve more than they ever thought they could or uh, believe was possible, right? So sales rep, you get to focus on yourself, you get to focus on your quota, you don't really have to worry about other people. But as a sales manager, you actually have to get rid of worrying about yourself. You can't worry about yourself at all and you have to go all in, all of your attention and effort on helping the sales reps maximize their goals, achieve their dreams, hit their targets, hit their quota, close sales, book more appointments, you name it. This show is sponsored by Seamless.ai, the world's best sales leads. Get direct dials, emails, and cell phones for anyone in seconds. Request an invite to join for free at Seamless.ai. That's Seamless.ai. It's a totally different mindset. So when you're thinking about, hey, sales rep to sales manager, Number one thing that you gotta make sure is are they team oriented? Are they able to put their needs and wants aside for the needs and wants of their reps? It's kind of like being a dad or a mom. I don't have kids, but all I know is growing up, you know, my family would put their own needs aside to make sure that I was fed, I was taken care of, I was given a good school, good education, you name it. Sales management is very similar to parenting in a way. You gotta do whatever it takes to help your salespeople be successful. And then also, my top sales reps that became sales managers, the reason why they were successful was because they were not only able to inspire and lead and help their team, but they could also incorporate the daily, weekly, monthly accountability, the KPI tracking, the performance reviews, the coaching, the support, the effort, the energy, you name it. They're able to do all of those things where bad sales managers that came from sales reps, they wouldn't hold weekly one-on-ones with their team. They wouldn't help them do this. They wouldn't help them do that, you name it. So your goal as a sales manager is to help your reps achieve more, do more, accomplish more, and then hold them accountable every day, every week, every month, also, one of the biggest problems I noticed too is when sales managers who were sales reps try to treat all the sales reps as friends versus running a business. Yes, the salespeople that used to be your peers are your friends and you can be friendly with them. You've got a business to run, you've got a business to blow up. You have to literally hold them accountable like friendship aside, it's not personal, this is business. Hold them accountable to hit their goals, hit their dreams, hit their KPIs, drive results, accomplish the impossible, you name it. So thank you so much everyone for tuning in. Uh, it's your host, Brandon Bordanson here on Management Secrets. We drop a new sales secret show every single day. So make sure you click that subscribe button below so you never miss an episode. Watch on every single channel, YouTube, podcast, LinkedIn. We drop them daily, exclusive brand new content. Thanks so much. Your success is our success. Let's make this next year your biggest and best yet. There is no Q5. Thank you for listening to Sales Secrets with Brandon Bernanson. If you enjoyed the show, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button right now so you never miss an episode that drops on the daily. Your success is our success. This show is sponsored by Seamless.ai. 
the world's best sales leads. Get direct dials, emails, and cell phones for anyone in seconds. Request an invite to join for free at Seamless.ai. That's Seamless.ai.